Champ and I are on our way up to Quebec. We're gonna hang out with uh, Kelsey and Corbin again before they leave. And uh, we're also hanging out with Sam. I don't know if you remember Sam, but uh, he's got a plot of land up here and then gets snow and we're gonna go check it out. Looks like we're the first ones here, champ. Actually, hold on. Hey. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa. Who's that guy? Oh. So this will be like, you and I, we know Quebec, right? But this will be Kelsey and Corbin's first time in Quebec ever. Um, I brought some Canadian stuff for them to enjoy tonight, some food and stuff. like. I got the ketchup chips, don't worry. I know you were worried, you were very concerned. I wasn't gonna get the ketchup chips, but they're there. Good. I don't know. Like, what, what, what would be your words of advice for like somebody coming to Quebec for the first time? Check out the lakes, man. A million and lakes. And the hills. Lakes There's and the hills. A million lakes. I know, we've got 50 lakes within a 10 kilometer radius here. Wow. Yep. I could believe it, man. The, yep. the drive up here is spectacular. And this is like my backyard, right? Yeah, exactly. This is like, this exactly. is a 10 minute drive from downtown Ottawa. the bridge and you're, you're right here, man. <sighs> Love this Even city. the temperature goes down a little bit. Too. I noticed that too. Yeah, it got a little cooler. <laughs> yeah, upside down in the water. Look at this little frog. Fashionably late, these guys. Wouldn't believe it, but their van's actually considerably bigger than mine. You can see it from like the front grill, right? Yeah. Like that's a big block grill. Yeah. That's that's not a big block. Yeah. This thing. It's not a 350. Uh, they're both E350s, they're both one-ton frames. Yeah, they're running a 7.5 liter carbureted monster in there. Hello! You made it up those... How'd you like those roads? That's great. I felt like my whole van was gonna fall apart. <laughs> yeah, man. I couldn't believe it. you were like complaining about Canadian roads. I was like, I haven't even been to yeah. Quebec, man. Yeah. You don't know. Well, that wasn't as bad as New York, to be honest. Oh really? Yeah, that we was like, some... that was like butter compared to New York. No way. Yeah, you have you've been down some bad roads in New York. I don't ever find bad roads yeah. like that in New York. I've been in roads where like literally the cliff had eaten half the road, and so we're just like no way. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It was scary. wow. Oh, right. that's a dually. Oh, she's a big girl. Nice. She's a big nice. girl. Well, welcome in. Yeah. Welcome Thanks. to Jeff, you know? It's a big rig with a low hitch, so it's a little tricky getting her in, but. Fuck yeah, she'll go. Sam, you can tell I've fully moved into your space now. The canopy is up. Yep, it's legit. You're fully moved. I in, live man. here now. <laughs> I live here. Champ's uh, found all his favorite spots already. Nice. Sweet. Good camp. I just want you to know you're diving in the deep end with the all dress there. Am I? Yeah. Oh yeah. All dressed is like. Not at first. Oh, that don't. That's strong. That's not good. She likes strong flavors. Okay, good. If you like these strong flavors, all dressed is all you then. It's my favorite flavor. Mmm. Is it good? I really like it. Well, I like it. Let's see. There we go. Oh, that's good. It tastes like a mix of a lot of flavors. Yeah, exactly. Like vinegar. Yeah. And. And Sorry once you have onion. ketchup, you'll notice ketchup's definitely in there. Oh, I'm afraid to try ketchup. Ke ketchup's definitely in there. Doesn't taste like actual ketchup. It's exactly. a whole it other flavor. Like barbecue chips. It's like know. super salty, seasony, vinegary barbecue. There's barbecue. It doesn't taste anything like that though. 
Barbecue is like almost sweet. It's not very like that's tangy. You're insulting me right now. I don't think it's that hard. Um, what does uh, Matt and Danielle do it? Really? They're vegan. Oh my God. Oh, the race is really going now. Got to... Get a little cramped in there. Just a little. So this is Sam's entire rig here. He's got a two-door Jeep, and he's got a tiny little aluminum trailer. And he's custom fitted everything on the inside to make it as comfortable as possible without having to sacrifice any of his mobility. And the cool thing about this rig is it's totally off-road capable, which I sorely, sorely miss in my van. But uh, let's take a look inside. Tall people. It's not built for tall people. This I trailer is dope. I didn't even, hold on. Oh. Go Actually, you were, you were okay in there. Yeah. This is it. Got a custom sink. You did all this work yourself. Yep. Which is really nice. Actually, everything in here you've done yourself. Yep. It's all from scratch. You even got the vinyl floor. All insulated. Uh, weather sealed. Storage down here yep. under the bed. You got a little closet. And that, that is... Correct me if I'm wrong, that's an air conditioner. That is an air conditioner, portable air conditioner. Wow. And uh, it works off the exhaust. There's an exhaust uh, blower yeah. on the side, and I just connect them both, or yeah, I just have right. ventilation. That's fantastic. Yep. And then you got your battery bank under here. Yep, uh, it's over here. So, We've got a deep cycle, Yeah. 105 amp hour, and a charger here. Yeah. I'm going on uh, on a maybe bigger uh, bank and a uh, and a solar panel. Yeah, don't we? We always want the bigger bank. That's right. So we're always about that bigger bank. That's right. You got a monitor here. Swivel. Yeah, a little monitor. So definitely the kind of rig best set up for you know overlanding it to somewhere cool, That's setting right. up and staying there a week. That is right. Correct. Yeah, yeah. In fact, it was built because this is a ramp in the back. Yeah. I can always pull my motorcycle or dirt bike right. on the side. Right. Yeah, so, that would be where it's at, man. Oh my God. Oh, it's small, but it's precisely what you wanted and what you needed. And that's the exactly. cool thing about doing it custom. Exactly. Yeah. I show you the shower over here. Oh yeah, so. the emergency shower here. Yeah. So the, the the curtains hang on on all the uh, plastic uh, PVC pipes here, and it just drains into a, a bucket. Yeah. Uh, for emergency showers. Well, for that week when you're out in the mountains of Utah or whatever, exactly. right? Exactly. Exactly. And I got the air conditioning to uh, take the humidity off. If you're not gonna live like a kind of man, you better not smell like one either, right? <laughs> exactly. All right, cool. Well, thanks for yeah, showing us. Thank you, thank you. And you can check Sam out. I've, I've mentioned it check. before, but check his channel out. The, Sam's uh, Travel. The window installation is already on my channel, yeah, Sam Travels. You're not really vlogging so much as you're doing a lot of how-tos, which is cool. Yeah. Yeah, I like that. Yeah. Well, I'm doing how-to because it's easier. Yeah. It's a yeah. good start for vlogging. Yeah, yeah. Um, well, I see you're cracking out your camera more and more. It's good. It's good, man. Thank you, guys. All right, let's go eat some dinner. Welcome in. Thank you.